Hey guys, it's Lucky Girl B and I'm back with The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 3 in harm's way and it looks like this chick about to have her baby let's get into it previously on the walking dead okay this is the first episode okay think about it you're carver what do you do all right we're gonna meet carvers like people and stuff they took us People like Matthew aren't coming back. All right. I feel bad about Matthew. I forgot about it for a second. Ooh, Nick. I, I think I saved Nick. Yeah. Yeah, these are Carver's people we're going to meet. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Oh, my God. Woo. We're going home. As a family. Wait a second, what? Did, I didn't run to save Alvin, did I? I don't recall that. Okay, whatever. Um. I can't, I told us to all come. Oh, maybe I did, I don't know. I, I said don't, pl don't hurt him. Why are we just staring at him off? Okay, I guess we click on this moth. You well, look done over there. <laughs> yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. Oh, she had to go pee. I know they made you. It's uh, so nice that you came. We're safer we're together. We're safer if we stick together. Yeah. It's gonna be dark soon. Yeah, I know. But it's cool you came. I thought they were gonna tell my dad to go with me. Thanks. You're welcome. Aw, we got a bestie. Everything come out all right, girls? Come all right? Ew. Everything Troy, came out? tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carve her out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk Why back. We look, is that our walkie-talkie? No. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. How, what am I supposed to listen to? Um, Where's your manners? I used to have a walkie-talkie like that. Oh, really? And what happened to it? Because uh, you can't have this one. I used it to talk to my parents. Is that why you're looking at this one? Do you want to call mommy and daddy? You don't have to be a dick about it. I don't it. need it anymore. My parents are dead. Everybody's parents are dead. And that don't make you special. Oh, asshole. My dad's alive. And we're all grateful for that. Get the girls in back with the rest of them. We I should have gotten smart with him. Us. I should have just stared or told him none of your business. I thought I could try and play up his emotion. He has none. Dang, yo. It's like, where are we going to go? We tied up. And Sarah is useless. So are why you are you okay? acting like she gonna run? The hell did he do to you? Hey, did he hurt you? Nah, we hey. good. Hey. Oh, okay. <laughs> the, the Walking Dead. <laughs> Maybe we not good. I don't know. I'm afraid. If anything happens to Clem, I will freak. Uh, if something happens to Kenny after we just got him back, I'll really be pissed. You know. So like. <sighs> I seen the trailer for um, episode 3 and I seen the trailer for episode 4 so I know what's going to happen to Kenny. I just don't know the extent of what's going to happen to everyone. I'm, I'm worried about that. Uh, I, From what I hear, bad things happen to Sharita. So, we just really back here in the truck. Can I do something? I can't do anything. I'm trying. <laughs> We're still in cinematic. We just... Bumping along in the back of the truck, not talking. Did they gag? We're not gagged. Come on, anyone got anything sharp? Anything? Do we? Do we? It'd be cool we if we get did. These bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. Is and what that good a, is that gonna do? 
the hell is wrong with we you? We don't even have weapons, do we? Get out of here. Why bother? Why bother? What? How can you say that? I just don't see how it's gonna help. We're in a fucking precarious position. Well, I see we that. Do something about that. Sit down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill. Oh, because oh, Bill was. Yeah. Y'all were just getting a ride home, aren't you? No, that's Let's not it. Here. Bill's Stay her baby man. daddy. Stay out of this boy. That's Miss what I think. Boy. No, right. You're a man. You're Kenny Jr. <laughs> He's different. It's worse. The worse fuck than are what? You talking about? Uh, he wants to punish us. Uh. What do you mean worse? Yeah. He's a fucking psychopath now. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. Oh, don't, don't, don't bring that it's up. Not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying. That, but I know yeah. Bullshit. Yeah. Because that's a big ass me. word. I don't know what that means either. <laughs> oh, shit. Jackpot. Kenny, stop doing stupid kill. stuff, man. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah, uh, well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Kenny, please, calm down. I think everyone is just tired and cranky. She's right. We should all take it down a bit. It was true. We were locked up before. All right. And Kenny don't now care. Talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> Why is this one crying? At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it. Yeah, where is Luke? They didn't get Luke. Anything can happen out there. I thought maybe they had Luke. He abandoned us. Maybe Luke went back with them. He ain't here. He may not be around. Uh. Just leave us behind. We'll have to wait and see. Wait and see. Yeah. That's all we can do. I can't wait till we find Luke. No way to know what's happened to him. I told you. Cause I liked Luke. I'll be really pissed if he if he uh he left us out in the lurch and left us hanging. That's not cool. Okay. How do they know? They have guns. The, exactly he knows the familiar to bump. I'm punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Sure. Sit, Great. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't you know? Do oh Lord, I got my hands on the arrows in case good. they want me to do something. Cause I gotta take care of everybody. You trust me, right? Oh, we backing up. Kenny, please, just, just listen to them. I'm scared. <laughs> I, I'm scared, Kenny. Okay, um, that's okay. That's okay. All right. Oh shh. Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? He got knocked the fuck I think out. So. Oh, what hit me? <laughs> the truck. Probably for the best. Yeah, honestly. Wish we could tie him back up so they wouldn't know we did something. Cause now, you know, we ain't got nothing. Uh, fresh fish. We're fish. Goddamn crazy, we're gonna do shit. Oh snap! All right, up and out. This mother, this chick. She is here. This is the safety. The what? You get your restraints off. Uh oh. Come here. Uh. They, they, Yo, that Latavia, Latasha, Letitia, whatever that bitch's name was. Yo, she ain't no good. I thought she was good. I was convincing people to go with her. Oh my god. I think I made some bad choices in 400 days if we all ended up with this lady. Maybe the people who didn't come with us had it right. I don't know. This ain't, this don't look good. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm talking all over this no man. Look how much food they have. That's nice. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. <laughs> saying let's grab a can then run. A lot of workers. Oh, a herd of workers. Just come the fuck on. His hands are broken. What he gonna do? I need him. I need my dad. Girl, he gone. 
Girl, he gone. Gonna have to look after yourself. Uh, he'll be back. He'll be back. When? I don't know. But he will come back. Thanks, Clem. I hope I'm not lying to her. I shouldn't have said that. What if they kill him? Make sure y'all stay off the fence. Bill can see if you're messing with it. Oh, boy. Thanks, Barney. Yep. Wait a minute, Nick. Wait, was Nick outside when we met Bonnie? I don't think so. Or was he? I don't remember. Some rest. Cause there ain't gonna be much for you to say how he know Bonnie. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold. But at least I'll be comfortable. Hey guys. Reggie. Hey I'm guys, so sorry. Oh, with a missing so sorry. arm. Hello. What did they do to you? This could have been worse. Trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should. Say Reggie helped us. You, but okay, what happened, to away. Uh, what happened to his arm? What happened to his arm? What happened to his arm? I don't know. We were all running out together, but then he fell, and everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. Did they cut off his arm as punishment? They got me working outside. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Oh. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. Oh. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? No. Don't make this difficult. No. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. That don't mean he won't fine. do it now. Let's he wasn't going to do it in front of her. He wants to kill you because he trying to... He got your hey, wife knocked hey, up. Oh, hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. Hmm. Oh, right. Let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Hello. Okay. Who are you? I'm Clementine. This freaks you out. My no, it doesn't. Clementine. It doesn't freak me out. Very nice to meet you, Clementine. He reminds me of Chaft from the Hunger Games. Looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Oh, yeah. Can you guys save it for the morning? Okay. Someone's gotta be up early. Who's that? Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired, but <laughs> like I said, he saved my life, so I put up with that shit. <laughs> Don't put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, you said once you were all gone, he let me. She read dirty the group, looking. So Who's she? I'm glad you're here. She I'm getting us evil eyes. I know. I mean, Who is he she? didn't say that, but I'm not happy about it. Who's she? Huh? Who? The girl over there? Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just, like, the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. She's covered in guts. Look, she's smart. It's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. Is he we drinking the Kool-Aid? When was the last time you had electricity, huh? We had a windmill. Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, <laughs> it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. 
Bill is making it happen. He's yeah, he drinking the Kool-Aid. I've made mistakes. And Carver killed my friend. Me. Carver killed my friend Walter. He didn't okay, do anything. I, I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his reasons. His reason is he's a crazy piece of shit. Yes. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you <laughs> think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to People like that trouble? are dangerous. At least until they release me. We won't get then you in trouble. Once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. We won't get you in trouble. They're expecting me to keep things in line out here. Well, if Carver's such a great guy, I'm sure you've got nothing to worry about. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't okay. believe you're here. Look, the fact <laughs> is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. <laughs> Bridget, I don't want a second chance. Yeah, I want I to want be out of here. My family. That's it. Your family is safer here. That Kool-Aid <sighs> talking. I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. She's gonna have that baby uh, soon. Didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Yeah, there ain't no damn plan here. Man, fuck that guy. <laughs> I don't think we can trust him. Uh, Clearly, he's already he's just scared. Much he's on that Kool Aid. I think he's just scared. Everybody's scared. Ain't an excuse to sound like a nutcase. You gotta take a look around. Okay, we'll look around. If there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. Okay. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Well. What should I be looking for? Stuff that they don't want us to know about. Okay. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Um, okay, I gotta look around. So, uh... Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yeah. Yep, I was, uh, distracted. That guy's on the Kool-Aid. I'm not gonna bother the people right now. Stuff. I saw its shadow. People who just follow people blindly and truly believe they have your best interest at heart, I don't trust them. Guess it's better than the ground. It's not. <laughs> I'm gonna leave Nick alone. Okay, what's this over here? Shelves? Hmm, it looks rickety. Well, that's not good. We can't climb out that way. I still think he got higher than he needed to. I don't feel like there's any need to talk to the people in my group. Because... What are they gonna tell me? We've had a bad time in that truck. Ooh, what's this? Soil. Okay. It looks kind of crappy. I saw a fella try that. <laughs> yeah, it's probably ago. full of manure. Up what's the mounds. fence gap? Ended up the anyway. fence boards. Yeah, like I said, it felt like Mike had done it before. Did a tourniquet on me real quick. Oh, I do not want to pull on it. I'll just look at it. Well, if I pull it and a walker comes through. Well, not this place seems pretty secure. Hose real. Oh, why did I stop walking? So how did you end up with a name uh -huh. like that? Kenny! What? I'm just asking. No, it's okay. It's not my real name. On my first day in the US, I stopped and got a coffee, and the girl behind the counter asked me my name, so I told her it's Rajiv. Ouch. I just stood there and <laughs> I yelled Reggie for five minutes. And that's when I thought I should really get out ahead of this. Huh. How would we get up there though? Is this hole gonna help? <clears throat> oh, they didn't notice me pulling that, so let me try and pull on this plank then. He doesn't seem to be noticing. Let's see if I can pull on this a little bit. Hey, Clem, come Ooh. on. Don't be like that. Ooh. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? I'm a, uh, uh, I'm a kid. I touch things. I'm not trying to find a way to escape out of this obvious prison cult place. No, I'm just uh, touching things because I'm a curious child who, who isn't a threat to anyone. 
Okay, I won't touch it. I'll just look because he getting all antsy. Reminds me of the jewelry store. Oh no, baby, don't think about that. I don't want to touch it because I don't want the man to freak out. If if I touch a lot of stuff and then uh, he gets all pissed at me, you know, I just don't want nothing like that to happen. Uh, talk to Sarah. Fuck Sarah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just you know Sarah's kind of like, Ugh. what's that thing? That's like an ugly fish. I'll look at that in a second. Hello. Get lost. Oh, well, fuck you, my nigga. Ugly. You can tell, like, this is where this is one of them stores, like, where they sell all the ugly fish and and gardening stuff. <laughs> we didn't even bother to talk to her. She just gave us that eye. We just like, okay, whatever. <laughs> 